Hey, good morning everybody. Hope you're having a great day so far. Ah, it's a beautiful day. No clouds. It's not cold. Early on a Sunday. <laughs> <laughs> Dunkin' Donuts. It's my initial. D. D. It's actually really warm out. Yeah, the car's at 50 right now. It's gonna be possibly in the 60s. Well, I don't know because... No? When we were looking at this truck yesterday and driving around, it was so windy, it felt... It said it was 42, but it said it felt like it was 18. So... Yeah, it was so cold. The guy was actually like nice enough to stick one of those mounts on there. Yeah, and I also got the uh, Go Knuckles. Diana's gonna be using those. <laughs> it's like going back to school again. <laughs> There's our snowmobiles. Look really nice. So those are bear claw marks, right there. All along the side of that tree. over there it's a great drive you should do it while you're up here where most people get their moose sightings oh really yep stop here look at this mountain man it's so nice it's just surrounded by mountains. so I just started using these go knuckles and I actually like it a lot um, it was really awesome to use on the uh, the snowmobile because I was kind of afraid I was kind of afraid of dropping it but the knuckles it's it's like a brass knuckle literally and it's not going anywhere as long as your fingers are in there they're not gonna fall um, yeah not sure how stable it looks because I haven't edited with it yet or checked out any of the shots um, but I don't know I like it so far it's pretty cool and yeah I'm using it right now can't really see but I guess whatever <laughs> 
Okay, so the one thing I'm seeing in this place is like there's a lot of like UFO sightings. Like, uh, you see here, like, the true story of the world's first documented alien abduction captured the Betty and Barney Hill UFO experience. Yeah, you know, like pictures of like a thing. Wow, this is weird. A picture of what the alien, I guess, looked like. <laughs> really freaky. Um, so yeah, it's pretty weird. <laughs> they must have a lot of aliens walking in, you know, getting some snacks and all that gas for their UFOs. <laughs> I wonder though, you think, I mean, I don't think we're the only ones that live in this universe. We're the only ones that live on Earth, yeah, but there's gotta be somebody out there. Mm -hmm. Somebody or something besides us, definitely. So we are now at Nashua, New Hampshire. And you can see there, we're at Sky Venture. Indoor skydiving. You ready to go? Yeah, it's real hot in here right now. I'm like nervous. All right, so we just finished the skydiving. Oh my God, that was so much fun. Yeah, that was crazy. That's not what I expected at all. I've never done real skydiving before and I'm not sure if I ever will, but that was definitely a lot of fun. That was better than I even, what I was expecting. Um, so what are you doing? Oh, I thought you were just leaving. No. Um, so in another hour, I'm gonna be doing the surfing
different than real surfing. Um, and on my one fall, I kind of like hit on my shoulder kind of hard and my neck, neck kind of snapped a little bit. Uh, but I think I'm okay. <laughs> um, but yeah, now we got a four and a half hour drive. Yeah, we're gonna be home at around one o'clock. 1 a.m. and it's uh, about 8.30 right now. So yeah, long drive. So that's it, we made it home. It's 1.20. I am so tired right now and I just need to get to bed. I didn't sleep good last night, so I definitely need to sleep tonight. Um, just happy to be home. I can finally relax. That drive was brutal. It took a long time. What are you doing? All right guys, so I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Ah!